Hi, we're back. Uh, I crossed the Long Bridge and on the other side of the Long Bridge is another mural that um, we put together in 2014. And in this case, um, we are commemorating Queen Elizabeth's Diamond Jubilee. So she is now the longest running monarch. Um, she holds a record for that and we thought because she does, uh, or she did in the past, and the monarch um, does come, um, monarchy comes here occasionally. We thought it was very important to represent um, this mark of, uh, of special events to commemorate her, her 60 years of monarchy. And um, this project has about 150 tiles and again each was hand cut and um, the actual design was created by uh, Mrs. Cornea's class um, in 2014. So her class and her design, the, um, the mural, and um, it was a lot of her students uh, through her school that came um, to um, create the tiles. So let's have a closer look. On the top, you can see celebrating Elizabeth II's Diamond Jubilee, 1953. And you see the flags of the different countries that um, um, she reigns over. Uh, an image of one of her crowns. And then as we get a little bit closer to the bottom, um, 60 represents how many years she uh, has reigned. On the bottom, we always like to indicate um, and thank our people that participated in the project. And um, there's a plaque that's on the bottom. Um, it was very important that um, we had help from uh, the city of Moose Jaw and uh, Scott Ward uh, spent a lot of time helping us with the designing of the uh, frame that goes around this. So uh, this is our second um, public mural that we did with um, our education programming at the Moosejaw Museum and Art Gallery. Our third mural that we did is right beside this one. And this one is uh, commemorating Crescent Park's 100th anniversary in Moosejaw. And um, for this project, um, we actually um, got a map of a bird's eye view of Crescent Park and uh, designed it to look overhead. So when we have a closer look at this, it was created in 2011-2012 and um, you can see that there is um, on the top portion of the uh, mural, there is Crescent Park, the dates, 2011-2012 and if we go back a little bit you can see the actual hook of the crescent I should say of uh, the shape of the river that goes through here the creek and um, there's a mapping of things like the Moose Jaw Museum and Art Gallery the public library um, the Senatal the Rose Garden the time capsule the amphitheater the spa over in this section, and the outdoor pool, the natatorium, um, the no longer YMYWCA, and the tennis courts, and the lawn bowling. So um, it is all made by students in the community, and beside it are all of the people we wanted to thank that helped with this project. Um, this project, there is well over 250 tiles, and again, uh, we always like to represent something that uh, we're commemorating in Crescent Park. So those are our public um, ceramic tile projects that um, we have done um, in Crescent Park, and um, we'd like to show you some more things um, in other episodes of uh, the history and interesting facts about Crescent Park.